Happy Wednesday morning, South Jersey. It's meteorologist Joe Martucci. We are in store for another beautifully bright day, just like my suit here. But we have to get over a little bit of fog first, well inland today. So we take a look at our golf forecast. We'll go with good for inland areas. Really after 9 o'clock, that fog is gone, and we are going to a summery day here with not all that much humidity. And at the shore, we sink it in the cup. No fog at the shore, just another beautiful day to be out and about. So whether you're in Brigantine or you're at Green Tree for some golf, you're looking good there. We take a look at our future cast here. High pressure remains large and in charge for today, keeping our skies clear. It will shift offshore and weaken as we go into Thursday. Still going to be a dry day, but some clouds will come in during the PM hours. And then for Friday, we're talking about some rain as we go into the afternoon, along with a good amount of drizzle as well. We'll talk about that in just a minute. We take a look at our muggy cast for you. Smiles all around this morning. We'll get a little humid as we go into the afternoon. Not that much. You know, it is October. It can't get super humid out. And then as we go into our Wednesday night, we get back to that dry category. And then a little bit more humidity comes into our life as we go into Thursday. And that humidity will actually go up as we go into Friday. But still, not that sticky July, August kind of feel. Now, let's time out this Friday into Saturday system. We're talking about drizzle or a shower or two on Friday. Then we go to Saturday. Rain starts between 6 to 9 a.m. This is my first forecast on the timing, so this could change. But I do believe that this is not an all-day soaker because I think there'll even be breaks in between these times. But by the time it ends 3 to 6, you don't have a lot of dry time afterwards. It gets windy, too, on the back edge of this as well. And that would continue right through Sunday. Forecast rainfall totals generally under a half inch here. We don't really need the rain. We'll still take a little bit, but we don't really need it. And then we look at Stafford. That could be a little bit higher. And really anywhere in those blues could be a little bit over a half inch. Here's a look at your inland seven-day forecast. Staying good for Wednesday. Even Thursday is not going to be bad. We just got some clouds late. Friday's just more misty rather than rainy, so if you can handle that, you're fine here. Then we go into Saturday, 70 degrees for the high temperature. It's raining for a good portion of the day, and when it stops raining, it clears out, but it gets windy. It'll be windy Saturday night, and that helps to usher in a new air mass for Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, where it's that autumnal pumpkin spice apple pie kind of feel with temperatures in the 60s during the day and morning lows in the 40s to even around 50 degrees.